Hi, today I'm going to show you how to do an exercise called a stability ball dumbbell press. Uh, you're going to need two pieces of equipment. The first one is a stability ball. The size of the stability ball is going to depend on your size. Um, for bigger people, the bigger size balls are better, um, 65 or 75 centimeters. This one is a smaller one, it is 55 centimeters. Your second piece of equipment is going to be a pair of dumbbells. And you want to keep those dumbbells on you as you get set to go into the movement. Here we go. I'm going to show you what this looks like from the side. You're going to be sitting on your stability ball, dumbbells in hand, and we're going to slowly walk forwards. As you walk forward, try and tuck your hips down. Let your back and your spine roll along the ball. And you want to go so far as to have the ball underneath the shoulder blades. You want to be able to push your shoulder blades back and your shoulders back and to be able to feel the ball supporting you there. Um, you want to make sure that your hips are raised and your feet are both flat on the floor and uh, an even distance apart, about shoulder width. And from this position, you then take the dumbbells and we're going to start right about here. You want to have your palms facing forward so that they're facing down. Okay, and in the start position you should have it so that your, uh, your upper arms are slightly lower than parallel to the floor. So rather than having your arms perfectly parallel to the floor, you want to go down just a little bit. And the distance that they want to be is about mid-chest height. So they're not over your neck and they're not over your abdomen. So we're going to keep them at about mid-chest. I'm going to look up, relax, take a deep breath, and as you exhale, you want to push up towards the uh, ceiling. As you push up, you'll notice that your hands will want to naturally come together. That's all right. Inhale as you come down. Exhale as you press up. You can count two seconds up and two seconds down, or three seconds down and three seconds up. You might notice here a little bit of pain in the neck. That is very common because uh, exercises are not usually done in a position like this. Um, so the muscles of your neck might be um, not used to it. That's perfectly normal. Always keep control of the hands and make sure that the dumbbells are moving at equal heights. They're not coming down separately, but always together. And you can place the dumbbells down on the ground when you've done your set. And we're just going to come up the same way that we went down. You're going to walk back on the ball until you're back into your upright position. Um, a great exercise that is really going to focus on working the pecs, and because you're using the stability ball, it's also going to work the uh, core muscles, the abdominals, um, rectus abdominis, obliques, the transverse of, of abdominal muscles, and a great strength training exercise here. Uh, but that's everything you're going to need to know on how to do a stability ball dumbbell.